Hey guys, welcome back to Shift Elements where we talk about moving essentials and we make them as easy as possible for you. If this is your first time to my channel, then kindly hit that like button and subscribe so you can stay up to date with all the new moving essentials. In today's video, we're actually going to go over how to package a slightly bigger pitcher into a mirror box. This is actually part two, so I'm, let's jump right into it. Let's get started. So today, we're actually going to wrap up this big boy. It's slightly bigger, well it's a lot bigger than the other pictures in the um, previous video, but I'm going to show you guys how to wrap it up and get into the mirror box. Here we go. So with slightly bigger pictures like so, I like to use a little bit of tape so that way I can hold it together before I get it into the mirror box. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the corner again like I was telling you before. You're going to wrap the paper over and then you're going to take a corner fold the corner in over you're going to still keep the paper smooth you're going to fold this corner in like so and then you're going to make a crease there so that way that's that's where you're folding it over so you hold on to it you're going to fold it over and you should have a little flat like so. You're gonna bring this over. And this is where I use the tape to hold it down until I can get it into the picture box. So I just put a little piece of tape like that. And as you can see, it's completely wrapped up front and back. So let's get it in the mirror box. So we're gonna do the bigger pictures. Um, well, bigger picture today. This is actually part two. So I'm gonna show you how to construct a box. If you watched the previous video, you already know how to do it. So if you wanna skip past this part, you can. But if you missed the previous video and you wanna see how to do it in this video, I'm just gonna walk through it. So first you're gonna fold in this flap. You're gonna fold this flap down and fold this flap over. And you're gonna take one piece of tape to secure it. Um, like I said in the previous video, I don't need a lot of tape on it. Um, because once you secure the box, then it will be secured up uh, perfectly. So, like I said, flap over, flap down, flap over. And then you're going to put a little tape to hold it. Today, we're actually going to do four pieces instead of two. In the other video, we actually did um, two, two pieces because it was a smaller um, picture that needed to be wrapped. But since it's bigger pictures today, then we're going to do bigger you know what I'm saying? Four pieces for a bigger box. So we're gonna do the same thing for all four. All right. So with the big, slightly bigger picture, um, you're gonna need two mirror boxes on the floor. So you're gonna slide one inside the other, face up, just like so. So you can actually place it inside. And then you're gonna take the picture and you're gonna slide it directly into the box, like so. And what I always do is I push it all the way to one side. I lift up the box and I tap it down so it's even. So it's, it's from one side of the box to the other. Then you're gonna take another box and you're gonna slide it. So, cause you, what you want is these grooves right here to line up together. So in order for you to do that, you gotta take this box and go this way over the groove and cover it and go down. And then when you put this box, the next box over on this side, it's gonna line up with that original groove as you can see. See that groove right there? It's all lined up all the way around now. So what you'll do, you'll stand it up and you're gonna take some tape around the groove. That's pretty much what you're doing. It's silly. 
Oh, the blue. So it's sealed up. It looks the same on the other side. So after you do that, then you're gonna lay it down. And you're gonna do the same thing around this area. Slide it down, make sure it's fairly secure. And as you can see, it's sealed up right there, and it's sealed up around the edge. So that's how you wrap a big picture. Well, bigger picture. I'm gonna show you the biggest one in part three of the mirror packing and picture series. Well, you can see how simple it is to wrap up a bigger picture. Um, you already seen the smaller one in the previous video and in the following video you'll see a bigger picture than that um, being wrapped up But that's is just that simple before you click off the video Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel so you can stay up to date with all the new moving essentials until next time